Probably having a plan B might be the biggest hurdle to the success of your plan A. A few years ago, a wise man gave me a very, very valuable lesson that literally changed the way I perceive my goals. I was in a period of my life that I needed to make a decision whether to continue with my plan A, pursuing my dream, or play safe and go with my plan B. This man gave me a story that literally changed my life. If you find yourself in a similar situation as me, probably this story can help you a lot. A man found himself surrounded around dead bodies, wake up 40 hours after the consequences of a plane crash. In the middle of nowhere, in the Andes mountains, 29 of 45 in that plane survived. They try any way to communicate for help without results. They found themselves without any food or water. So the only way for them to stay alive was to eat the bodies of the other passengers. On that plane were traveling also the mother and the sister of that man. So the man needed to make a decision to eat the body of his mom and sister or trying to find a way to survive. So he decided to go and search for help in the middle of nowhere he only could see snow. After three days of no food and barely any water, the man reached the top of that mountain, which was his first goal. Hoping for any, any kind of civilization or help from there. But what he found there, literally froze him. He only could see snow and more snow. He knew he was dead. The only choice he could have at that moment was go back and eat the bodies of his mom. Say either survive or die in the process, but I'm not going back. The agony and the pain were indescribable. The mountains were so huge that he couldn't even precise any type of progress. In his final source of energy, he found signs of someone being there recently, a can of soup. A few hours later, he saw a man on a horseback on the other side of the river. The man screaming desperately for his life. Lucky for him, the man on the horseback could hear him. Telling him the story, the man on the horseback took the man and bring him to the nearest village that he knew. Get the rescue team. A few hours later, they could save the other passengers that survived that plane crash. The only way you go forward is because you cannot go back. When the human mind excludes all the possibilities and focuses on a single path, that path takes every ounce of your passion, perseverance, and power. Leaving no room for hesitation, there is no reason to have a plan B because it distracts you from your plan A. Recent studies have shown that having a backup plan or even considering one has a significant effect by making you less driven to your primary goal. Now, there is a big difference between being brave and being stupid. When we're talking about putting all your eggs in one basket, I mean on a situation where there is a big risk, but a big reward. But if the reward is actually not that big, ask yourself, is the risk worth it? And when we talk about reward, doesn't mean to be materialistic, it can be love, can be happiness. Anything that for you means a big reward is worth the big risk. Remember, get rich or die trying it. 50 cents.